four people were being interviewed for the same job on the same day but in different rooms r1 r2 r3 and r4 at different time and by different interviewers right so there are four people who are you know uh, being interviewed for the same job on the same day but in different rooms now different rooms are r1 r2 r3 and r4 at different times so there are some different times there and by different interviewers and some data has been given here right there are some six points based on which you'll have to do the complete mapping right like who was interviewed by whom at what time and in which room right four people four interviewers so we have to map the interviewee with interviewer the room which they were using and at what time was it happening all right now read the statement right the first statement says tina's appointment was just after mr sharma's which was just after uh, that of the person in room two then Mr. Narurka's appointment was at least two hours later than Bimal's. Mr. Joshi's appointment was just after the person who had an interview in the room R4, who had an appointment just after Chirag. Then three of the four people were Deepak, the one with interview in room 1 and the one who was interviewed at 1 p.m. Interview times were 11 a.m., 12 noon, 1 p.m. and 2 p.m. So this is important, right? We were told that the interviews are being done at different times. And point 0.5 clearly mentions that the five different times are 11 a.m., 12 noon, 1 p.m. and 2 p.m. Sharma, Narurkar, Joshi and Zaidi were interviewers and Tina, Bimal, Chirag and Deepak were the interviews. So this sixth point talks about the names, right? Sharma, Narurkar, Joshi and Zaidi were the interviewers and Tina, Bimal, Chirag and Deepak were the interviewees. All right. So based on this data, we now have to complete the mapping. Mapping of interviewer with interviewee with the room and the Time. right so let's start doing that now now which point would you like to start with shall we start with point number one right let's let's start with point number one it says Tina's appointment was just after Mr. Sharma's which was just after that of the person in room two Tina's appointment remember Tina is an interviewee was just after Mr. Sharma's appointment who was an interviewer, right? So Tina's interview happened or Tina's appointment was after Mr. Sharma's appointment, which was just after the of the person in room two. So basically three different slots are being shown here in point number one. Tina's slot, Mr. Sharma's slot and room two's slot. So if we try and fix it, what happens? It is, it is like this. Uh, you know, Tina's appointment was just after Mr. Sharma. So let us assume... Uh, let us assume that this is uh, Mr. Sharma. Okay. Tina's appointment was just after Mr. Sharma's appointment. Which was just after that of the person in room 2. That means, I mean, if you, if you understand, we are trying to make a table here. Right? Interviewer's name, interviewee name, room name and the time. I mean, these are the four columns that we have to fill. Right? Interviewer, interviewee, room and time. So, Mr. Sharma was the interviewer. Uh, Tina's appointment was just after Mr. Sharma's appointment. So next comes Tina, which was, which here represents to the preceding person, right? So Mr. Sharma's appointment was just after that of the person in room 2. So this happened just after the person who was in room 2. So room 2 here. Or I think, let us take this as room 2. I'll, I'll let me draw a table here so that we can follow it easily. It, it is like this. I mean, you don't have to do this in the exam. But for the sake of clarity, let me just put it like this. You will to follow. So this is what is given in point number one. That Tina's appointment happened after Mr. Sharma's appointment. And Mr. Sharma's appointment was after, see Tina's appointment was just after Mr. Sharma's appointment, right? So Tina immediately after Mr. Sharma. And Mr. Sharma's appointment was just after the interview that happened in room two. So we are taking the interviewer's name in first column, interviewee's name in second column, the room number in third column and the time would be taken in the fourth column. Are you able to follow? Now if you see we have already got four slots here, right? Uh, we have already got three slots here, sorry, three slots, right? Of course, many cells are uh, empty, but three slots have been obtained. It is obvious that the fourth slot will either be on top or it will be at the bottom. Because these are three consecutive slots. Some Mr. X will come here, Mr. Y will come here, the other two persons will come here, some rooms will come here and times would come here. Now the fourth slot should either come on top or should come at the bottom. So those are the two possible cases. You're getting it? Those are the two possible cases here. 
So in one case you can take it on top, in the other case you can take it at the bottom. So what I would do is, first of all replicate this, whatever we have drawn so far, let me just quickly repeat that. I mean if you do it this way, it will be very very easy. You can read the other statements immediately and try to fill the gaps. But uh, you know this way you may have to write a little bit, but uh, cancelling some unwanted cases can become very very easy. So I will write Mr. Sharma. Tina and room 2. There is no difference. Both of them are same. Now what are we doing? In one case, let us take it on top. So I will say that the fourth slot is on top. Fourth slot meaning? See, these three are consecutive. Basically, R2, Sharma and Tina are consecutive. So either they can be the first three consecutive or the last three consecutive. I hope all of you have got this. Right? So here they are consecutive last three, here they are consecutive first three. That's what was given in point 1. That Tina, Sharma and R2 are consecutive. So we have drawn those three consecutive and then we have taken the fourth one, one in one case on top, in the other case at the bottom. Now try to fill the uh, gaps using the remaining points. So first point has been utilized properly. Next point, Mr. Narurka's appointment was at least two hours later than Bimal's. By the way, uh, before going to the second point, now that we have drawn all the four slots, we can note down the times. 11, 12, 1 and 2. See, we are talking about a particular order from the first slot to the last slot. Here also from the first slot to the last slot. So obviously the first slot was at 11 a.m. Second slot was at 12 p.m. Third was at 1 p.m. And 12 noon. Third was at 12 p.m. And the fourth one was at 2 noon. Uh, 2 p.m. Similarly here 11, 12, 1 and 2. Are you able to follow? So these are the four slots. You are getting it. Time is fixed from first slot to the last slot. Now if you see the second point says Mr. Narukar's appointment was at least two hours later than Bimal's. Mr. Narukar's appointment was at least two hours later than Bimal. Now there are many possibilities that can come here. Let us let us try out what are those possibilities. See, Narukar's appointment was at least two hours, minimum at least two hours later than Bimal's appointment. So what are the possibilities? Let us assume, I mean, Bimal comes in the 11 a.m. slot, in the first slot. Bimal comes here in this box, right? Let us assume Bimal comes here. This is just an assumption, right? Bimal comes here. Now, if Bimal comes here, where should Mr. Narurka come at least two hours later? So, if Bimal is at 11 a.m., Mr. Narurkar can either be at 1 p.m. or 2 p.m. You're getting it? Bimal is at 11 a.m. Mr. Narurkar should come at least two hours later. So, two hours later, what is the slot? 1 p.m. But this is already blocked by Mr. Sharma. So, maybe in that case, Mr. Narurkar will come in the 2 p.m. slot. Are you able to follow? So, if Bimal comes here, if Bimal comes here, According to case 1, let us assume if Bimal comes here, then Narurkar has to come only in this position. There is no other possibility because he is at least 2 hours later. His slot is at least 2 hours later. So, I can now confirm that Bimal is here. In that case, Mr. Narurkar would come here. There are other possibilities. There are other possibilities that Bimal can come in the second slot. Even in then, Mr. Narurkar can come in the fourth slot. I mean, that we will consider later. But the point is, if you consider Bimal in the first slot, then Mr. Narurkar will come in the last slot. Right? Look at the case 2 that we have taken. If Bimal comes here, if Bimal comes here, then Mr. Narurkar will come in the third slot or fourth slot. These are the two possibilities. Yes or no? So I think what happens is in the second case, again we are getting two possibilities. Bimal you can take in this position. Narurkar will either come in the third slot or in the fourth slot. Right? So let me fix it here. Yeah, but uh, yeah. So if you take Bimal in the yeah, so the point is. The two possible cases that we get here is if Bimal is in the first slot, Narurkar will come in third or fourth. But when you take in fourth, it has already been copied here. You are getting it. Let me just write Bimal here. If you take Bimal in the first slot, Narurkar can come, can come in third or fourth. But the fourth slot condition has already been considered in the first case itself. right? Bimal in first, Narurkar in the fourth one has been taken already. So what we can do is Bimal in the first one, let us take Narurkar in the third one. Yeah, but I think fourth one also has to be taken because let me let me just repeat it. I mean, see, remember, we have not gone to the next statement. Maybe when you read some statements, it may be easier. But I'm just trying to duplicate the cases and see what are the possibilities. I'll fix everything else first. R2. This was Tina. This was Mr. Sharma. I mean, space is the problem, biggest problem for me here. So what have we done here? In the first case, Bimal, if, I mean, according to the case one, there was only one possibility that Bimal comes on uh, this thing and Narurkar will come in the last one. 
the case 2 is giving us two possibilities. If you take Bimal on the first one, Narur can, can come in third slot or in the fourth slot. So Bimal in the first one, third slot we have already considered. Now let us consider the fourth slot. Mr. Narur comes here. You're able to follow. You're able to follow. So what is the point here? Uh, I mean, what is the difference in these two? Bimal is in the first only, Narukar is in third or in fourth. Now you may ask me a question that what is the difference between first and third case? This is second case, let us say, and this is the third case. What is the difference in the first case and third case? The difference is although Bimal is in first in both the cases, Narukar is in third in both the cases, but you see Sharma is in third slot here and Sharma is in second slot here. Accordingly, Tina is in fourth slot here, but Tina here is in third slot. So that's the change. And that is what we need to consider. So all these three cases are different, right? All these three cases that we have considered are different. Now try to uh, do the remaining, uh, I mean, try to fill the gaps and see which one comes out to satisfy all the conditions. Yes or no? Second point is done. Look at the third point. Mr. Joshi's appointment was just after the person who had an interview in room four. Mr. Joshi's appointment was just after the person who had an interview in room four who had an appointment just after Chirag. Now, this is again important. Joshi was just after room 4 and uh, you know, this room 4's appointment was just after Chirag. So, so if you look at point number 3, point number 3 here tells us that, you know, Chirag comes on top, after Chirag, room 4 comes and after 4, Joshi comes. Yes or no? Joshi's appointment was just after room 4's appointment and the room for appointment was just after Chirag. So basically these three are also consecutive. Chirag, room 4 and Joshi. Chirag, room 4 and Joshi. So try to fix that. Try to fix that. See, according to case 1, can Chirag come in the first slot? No, because Bimal has already come there. So Chirag has to come here. But if you take Chirag here, immediately next we want room 4. So room 4 can come here. But after that we want Mr. Joshi. But this has been already blocked by Mr. Narur. Are you able to follow? Chirag, room 4 and Joshi have to be consecutive. So if Chirag is in the second slot, room 4 comes in the third slot, fourth slot should be for Mr. Joshi, but here fourth slot is already blocked by Mr. Narul. So this is wrong. Yes or no? This does not satisfy all the conditions, right? So this is wrong. Now, uh, yeah, I think one more possibility is Bimal can be in the 12 p.m. slot also, which we have not taken here. But this is how you have to continue. I have a lack of space, so I'm not able to do it. But you guys can try that. In all the three cases, we have taken Bimal in the first 11 a.m. slot only. You can take him in 12 p.m. also. If Bimal comes in 12 p.m., the only possibility, Narur has to come in the uh, 2 p.m. slot. Right? I can see the chat that uh, some of you have mentioned that Bimal should be in, I mean, can be in 2 p.m., 12 p.m. Yes, Bimal can be in 12 p.m. Accordingly, Narur has to be taken in the fourth slot. But you just try it out yourself. I mean, I'm just trying to see with these three cases. I don't have space to work on, basically. Let us see if these three cases give us the answer. If these three fail, all the three fail, then we know that Bimal is in the 12 p.m. slot and Narur is in the 4, 2 p.m. slot. And from that we can complete it, right? So first one got ruled out. Try the same thing in second one, the third point, Chirag R4 Jushi. So Chirag has to come here. If Chirag comes here, R4 comes here and Mr. Joshi comes here. Yes or no? Try the same thing in the third case also. Chirag has to come here. Then R4 comes here. Then Mr. Joshi should come here. But this is already blocked by Mr. Naru. So third one is also is wrong. So first and third are ruled out. Answer is either the second one or something else which we have not considered. What did we not consider? Bimal in 12 p.m. and Mr. Naru in the 2 p.m. slot. So if second also goes wrong somewhere, let us say, what we can simply do is try with Bimal in the second uh, slot, Naru in the fourth slot and complete the remaining gaps. Fill the remaining gaps. So I think uh, this is done. Point number two is done. Point three also has been applied, right? Only case to satisfy. Now look at uh, what is given here next. It says uh, three of the four people, right? Three of the four people were Deepak. One person was Deepak. One person was the one who had interview in room one. And the third one was the one who had interview at 1 p.m. Now this is very important. See, very clearly we know that, I mean, three of the persons have come here, interviewers. So the fourth interviewer, Mr. Zaidi would come here. Right? And Deepak definitely will come here. Only thing is rooms are left out. Now we don't know room 1 and room 3 will take which of these cells. I mean, is it R1, R3 or R3, R1. Now this point would help us. Point number 4 would help us. What does point number 4 say? 3 out of the 4 people. There are 4 people, right? Like 4 people are Tina, Bimal, Chirag and Deepak. So he says 3 out of these 4 people are 1 is Deepak. 
वन इज दीपक द वन हु हैड इंटरव्यू इन रूम वन द वन हु हैड इंटरव्यू इन रूम वन एंड द वन हु वॉज इंटरव्यूड एट वन पी एम द ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड ही इज टॉकिंग अबाउट थ्री डिफरेंट पीपल सो वन पर्सन वॉज दीपक देन देर वॉज वन पर्सन हु हैड इंटरव्यू इन रूम वन एंड द वन हुड इंटरव्यू एट वन पी एम सो दीपक इज ऑलरेडी देर वन पी एम गाय इज टीना राइट दीपक इज वन पर्सन द वन पी एम इंटरव्यूअर इंटरव्यू वॉज टीना लुक एट पॉइंट नंबर I mean, part two of this. He says the other person was the one who had interviewed in room one. Now our confusion is: Will room one come here or here? Can you take room one in this place? No. If you take room one here, what happens? Deepak and the person who was in room one becomes the same. Yes or no? He says one person is Deepak, the other person is who had the interview in room one. If you take room one here itself, Deepak and the person in room one become the same. But he clearly mentions that three out of the four people were these three guys. so deepak and room 1 cannot go together you able to follow basically the idea here is deepak room 1 and 1 pm should be in three different slots these three cannot be together or no two of these can be together so clearly room 1 cannot come here room 1 has to come here and according to which room 3 comes here so i can now clear this and put room 3 are you able to follow he is indirectly told us that deepak and room 1 cannot be together because deepak is one person the one who had interview in room 1 is the other person and the one who had interview at 1 pm is a third person so these three have to be in three different slots so that is the reason room 1 cannot come here and i think it satisfies all the conditions whatever we have gone in got in case 2 has satisfied all the conditions right you can you can recheck the conditions again tina's appointment was just after mr sharma which was just after r2 so tina just after sharma which was just after r2 satisfied narurkar was at least 2 hours later than bimal yes narurkar was at least 2 hours later than bimal joshi was just after room 4 which was just after chirag so joshi just after room 4 which was just after chirag three of the four people anyway we just done slots are these and names are these so all the conditions are satisfied by case number 2 here so we can say this is the final answer